Hi, Bill here, and welcome to Bill's Retro Reviews. Today we'll be looking at Transformers Revenge of the Fallen Decepticon Ejector. As you can see, it's a toaster, and obviously it's in a bit bashed up. The paint apps are coming off it. There he is there, he's got a little plug there, a little bit of rope, a plug. There, yeah, yeah, and that's him. He's just a toaster from Revenge of the Fallen. Looking pretty neat. So to transform him, tell you what you do is you move these bits out, move these bits out. You split them open. Whoops, that was off screen. Just move them bits out like that. Move them out like this. I think that's his feet, to be honest. I think this bit comes out. Ah, you, you, you take the toaster bit and move it, swing it down. I think these are his arms. You move them down and out the way. He's actually open and his hands come out like this close them this does move down yeah this tends to get in the road okay you move that one down as well out the road like that, you move the face up and the face is supposed to sit up like that and you move these forward and that's his hands move them down move that up move that out move that out like that and you can have it like that <coughs> move this down as well and you have this arm like that he's weird he's got, he's got double arms or something <laughs> it's weird he's got these double arms let me go to do with that but as um, I'm just going to leave it back there have that like that Ah, a little feet come out. Little feet come out like that. Little feet come out like that. And you can stand them like this. You can stand them like this. And I think you stand them like that. And that is ah. You probably bring that back up like that to fill that gap in. And that is ejector. If he can stand, you have to angle the feet, you have to chicken leg the feet, so he can stand Yeah, that's ejector, standing Okay, that's him there like that so, pretty cool. Articulation, he's got the ball joints, he's got the arms, he can get right round that much in and out because it hits his face. He's got the ball joint there for the hands. He's got that hand that opens and closes, like that. This is a static one. Well, it just moves up and down like that. You don't get any movement on that. You can rotate this in the ball joint. You can close that over like that and open it. His mouth is open all the time. That's his giant mouth there with the teeth and that. I don't know if you can't bring it down because these are in the road and the legs go right back. Uh, 
can rotate these bits, but that's it. it doesn't have much in the way the we can move his leg right back like that forward. He can't really go out to the side much. Fits against kibble that prevents it. I don't think he can close his mouth. I thought he could close his mouth, but apparently he can't. Ah, he can. You can, you can, you can actually move his head forward like that. And he's so if you want that, you've got that. Although in the picture it shows him um, with his mouth wide open, but you can have it forward like that, or you can have it up like this with his mouth wide open. So you can have it both ways. It does work, and that's it. Okay. So that has been, and that's just, I don't even know if that comes off, no it doesn't, it's on there, I thought he could use that as a weapon, but it's just there as a tail kind of thing, <coughs> so that has been ejector, now if I can never get him to stand, that's the one thing with this pain the but the thing is that he just won't stand. It is impossible to stand this guy. I had him standing, but he, he just will not stand. Because we're going to do a size comparison, but if I can't get one done... Because uh, I can't get him to stand. <coughs> he just wants to lean back the way. There, that's the best I can do. Right, size comparison. Here is with Authentix Megatron. The small one. So, slightly smaller than Authentix. I take it that's somewhere between Legends and Deluxe. So if it's Legends, he's obviously smaller than that. <coughs> or slightly smaller. That's him. Okay. So I better end this video, I'll get it back to toaster mode and end the video, hold on. And there it is back in its toaster mode. So that has been Transformers Revenge of the Fallen Ejector, Decepticon Ejector. Okay, so look out for my next videos that are coming in this series and that's been me. Thank you very much, thank you, bye.